Sarah, as I stand here in front of you, I'm honestly amazed that God created someone like you. With your unique combination of characteristics, you're such a kind, caring, loving, compassionate, and sensitive person. Isaac, I'm so in awe to be standing up here with you, a wonderful man, a loving and true friend, and someone who roots themselves deeply in God's love. You have no idea how thankful I am that God brought you into my life. Two are better than one, because they have a good return for their labor. If either of them falls down, one can help the other up. But pity anyone who falls and has no one to help them up. Also, if two lie down, they will keep warm. But how can one keep warm alone? Though they may be overpowered, two can defend themselves. A cord of three strands is not quickly broken. Father, we thank you for this wonderful day of celebration of the love between Isaac and Sarah. We thank you that you made them, that you love them, and now that you invite them to reflect and display your love through their marriage. So by the power vested in me, I now pronounce you husband and wife. Isaac, you may kiss your bride. You two are amazing. I'm, I'm so excited for the life that you two have ahead of you. When I asked him about what it is about Sarah that he felt like this was the person for him, he said, I just feel like I'm at peace. I just feel like I'm at home. And as a mom, what else could you ask for? I've seen the same love and thoughtfulness in him, and I can honestly say that I can't think of anyone more worthy of her love. Cause all I want to do is make you smile when darkness still ensues i want to be alive light and evil, but rejoices with the truth. It always protects, always trusts, always hopes, always perseveres. Love never fails.